What's going on everybody? It's Patrick Minton Outdoors. I uh, wanted to bring you this quick video today for 9-11. Um, you know, that was, I remember every bit of that. Um, and I watched the replays of everything and it went down that day. Um, on 9-11, my mother was actually out of town for meetings in Texas. Um, you know, they come out with the announcement that there's no going to be no more air traffic until they can figure things out. So she was stuck in Texas, um, but she had gone down a couple days early to visit friends. So she had rented a car, and had it not been for her renting that car, there was no telling how she was going to get home. One of us had to go get her or something, bring her back home. One of the guys down there brought her home, or something. Something would have had to happen. But what's ironic about that, she rented that car. After the meeting was over with, um, her and three other guys from the company drove back to Tennessee. Now, here's, here's the deal. There was a guy that lived in Arkansas that was in the group, mom from Tennessee, and two guys from Illinois. They three drove that car that next morning to come home from Arkansas, from Dallas, Texas, to Arkansas, to Nashville, to Illinois. So, I'm sure there was a Texas car running around Illinois for a couple days until it got back south somehow. But, um, you know, had she not had gone down a couple days earlier and rented a car, I don't know, it had been kind of crazy for her to get home. But, um, anyway, you know... There's a lot of people that say, oh, you should, you know, forgive and forget. No, this is one time that I will not forget. This is one time I will never forgive what took place. Ten days from now, I will be getting on an airplane going to Florida. Does that run through my head what happened on 9-11? Yes, it does. Um, that runs through my head more than anything else that could ever happen. But anyways, um, I want to send my salute out on this 9-11 um, to everybody that served our country, fought, all those people that died that day, and all the people that died defending that day. Uh, thank you a lot. Um, you know, I, do I feel like we've got a handle on war on terror? I don't know. Don't know. We'll just have to see. But anyways, that's it for now, guys. Remember, never forget 9-11. Never forget what took place. Never forget how it happened. I appreciate you watching. Don't forget to subscribe, share, and like. And I'll see you on the next one, guys. Be prepared.